Welcome back everybody. <clears throat> Alright, I hope you all had an awesome day. If you like and subscribe, that would be pretty damn awesome. Now if you're not aware, Update 3 was literally released the day of uh, the last episode coming out. Uh, it's changed a few things, buildings get recycled, bots are different, uh, the storages for like things like this are also different. Um, and <clears throat> it has been suggested that perhaps I just do a restart. And we're, gonna, we're going to, but I'll do a quick little overview recap of this map. And then I'll have to save, exit, and then download the other update and bring it out. And I'll make all of it one half hour video. So the recap of this and the beginning of the next one uh, will be a single video. Why is there... huh none of them are meant to have been here oh never mind uh, I, I, okay fine i didn't never, didn't notice right so recap we started here in the middle okay uh we dammed off here first i think it was to hold the water back and start getting power generation going so we can get our industry up and running which is always right here where the first lot of trees are i bought it all in the same place can't help it um we then stretched out a little bit uh, it came up here and started getting more food and stretched over and grabbed the mine as we also started to stretch over this way uh we also built this giant dam at the at the bottom here i recommend this is something you try and do um create a couple spillways perhaps uh not like this but differently like a couple of blocks here as dams instead of just solid levees so the water never overflows that would be a good option uh, we dug a canal out along through here, into here. There's a big pool underneath this thing. Uh, how do we see it? How, how do I see it? Let, let me see the thing. Ah, never mind. There's a giant pool underneath this, helping to irrigate all this land here. We had just started opening up this industry to start building more golems, twice as many as normal. And we were going to create an entire golem area over here, uh, barrel bot only. We're going to link it to this new mine, which we'd also built. In order to help get uh, facilitate the uh, scrap metal we needed for metal blocks. Whew. However, we also built this lovely thing. This giant dam up here, Mega Project Dam. With a uh, spillway that well, I figured out about from, you know, that one down there. Uh, so the water never overflows and we can have these things shut if we want to. Yeah, bonk. But there's a drought so we needed it open so the water can keep flowing. Uh, we were also building, or uh, uh, starting to build this giant power thing. We're going to do this in the other map. We're still going to do this. Uh, we're just going to do it in the other map using all the lessons we've learned and the suggestions I've been given and the Skystorm videos I have watched. <laughs> so if you want to see a future, a, a future version of what, what we're doing, he's got a couple of good videos on the channel. Uh, we also did this. We uh, detonated the, the, um, the, the, the drop zone for the batteries right to the very bottom of the map. So they each hold about 26,000 horsepower each. Uh, we connected all the power first up to this uh, district up here. And then we connected it along this power line. This is power bar. I'm calling it a power bar because it's pretty much a bar of power. All the way down to this area here. So all our power is actually connected together. Uh, this isn't connected to anything but itself as it's just a test bed for our idea of the giant pump thing up here. And how we were doing all this as we were using golems so in the next map i'm going to try and do the same thing i'm going to make a town center where all the beavers live and they're going to start getting to golem production as soon as possible and we're going to use the golems to build the map so in the example down here we put a district in we put in biofuel we put in a couple of uh, drop-off points and we waited until the drop-off points were full of the goods they needed to build the, the tank before we end the and and biofuel before we shipped a couple of barrel bots over so they would build that thing get this uh, little district up and running and then we shipped in more barrel bots so all of these major projects this one um most of this one this one and uh all of this was all done just with golems uh we didn't use any beavers we didn't ship any water or any food up it was just fuel and materials required to build everything the plan was to come up here and build all the way down the side of the map irrigating all of this as we went along uh whether or not we'll do that in the other map i don't know because we're gonna go play helix um so yeah that's kind of the overview of how we started 
Uh, how to do this map though, I recommend is you go straight for the trees here, take out this little thing here, so this fills up with water, and fill all this up as much as you can with um, carrots or potatoes. Potatoes is best, because you get the grill, and um, you turn those potatoes into grilled potatoes, and you're pretty much set for a very long time. Um, despite the fact that uh, these guys have been living off raw potatoes because I paused their grill. How long ago? I have no idea. But I did it a while ago, and I really shouldn't have. But I think we did that because um, we weren't getting enough fuel produced. But we were, about, we were about to shut all this down, and then update 3 came out. Speaking of which, let's go. Alright, update 3, eh? We're going with Iron Teeth this time. And we're going to play it on Helix Mountain. It was a suggestion, and funnily enough, it was something I was going to bloody do anyway. <laughs> Alright, let's go. <sighs> okay. Yeah, this, this map requires a bit of a balance. I am just going to play it on normal. Um, easy's too easy. You want a bit of a challenge, right? Um, but the first time I played this, I got us up, I got up to like 30 beavers and then they all died. Well, not all of them, but, um, we'll call this, um, uh, Iron Teeth of YouTube. That's not how you spell it. Let's do it a capital T. Give it the importance it deserves. Hear that, Susan? Love you guys, right? <laughs> Okay, so this map, oof, this map's a little different. The water comes out of these, so there's there's one here. Instead of it running in from the side of the map, it comes out of this giant hole and circles this whole thing uh, down to here, where it then comes down this way. We will probably take that out at some point. Where it comes this way, uh, straight past us, down a waterfall, and off the side of the map. There is another one here. We can take out this. And have it flow down here so that's that, that that's the map sort of our first iron deposits probably going to be up here but this is all the ground we have to start with this is it um so yes all right uh, first things first straight roads eh <laughs> straight straight roads should, should we just do a straight road straight through um i don't like wasting space right so if i go like this Feels like I just wasted a bunch of space. Um, okay. We're going to need a couple of things right off the bat. We will definitely need a lumberjack flag. So we'll put him here for now. And we'll go with a straight road. <laughs> straight up. There is a set of stairs there and that will run straight into it. So that's actually not bad. Let's go like this. We'll grab all this. This will be what we dig out first. Now, there's only two logs per tree. And that's all we've got except for this little bit up here so we have to be quite sparing about it however what we want to do is we either want to dam off this or this first i am contemplating i'm contemplating this first it's bigger though but we need to do something to hold the water in when the first drought shows up speaking of which we're gonna need pumps one two get two pumps and now the road ain't straight no more <laughs> uh water tanks oh wait hang on Is it in oh wow right okay good thank you very much they um changed it if you couldn't tell St uh, water tanks are now in storage okay right we're gonna need at least i think it's three of these right at least three of those. Don't worry, I'm gonna re I'm gonna prioritize everything so everything, all the right stuff gets built in the correct manner. Um, we just need a bunch of stuff first, otherwise we're kind of screwed early game. These are in the wrong place. Ready, ready for the kink in the road again? <laughs> okay, back to this breeding pods. We'll do it this way around. Then we get the inventor. We can face it the other way. And that way we can build a road up around the corner. Like so. Although. Yeah, and put another adventure on site. Okay. Uh, we have the food. We have the wood. We have the water. Okay. Let's go. Priority. You. You. 
you, you, uh, we will down you, uh, you, and you. Yeah, let's do that. All right, speed three, please. Get to it, boys. Girls, beavers, well. Mm, Alright, we actually also gonna do this. Seems we got a bunch of unemployed people. <clears throat> Alright, good. Out goes the first guy make getting the uh, getting our wood for us. Because what do we need for you? We need twelve logs, so that's six trees plus fifteen logs, that's like another seven. We'll need this as soon as possible. <clears throat> so we probably need to up you to the green. Um you're good. We, do we need another one? Whoa, what the hell is this? Okay, cool. A lot of little changes. I like it. All right. Um, you need forty logs for the first house. It's forty logs. Uh, let's grab another one of you, so we're not actually. Actually, we we'll just grab two more. Oh, we only have one unemployed, and that's going to change very shortly. There it goes. Because once we get the first water pump, and we're going to need somebody working that as well. Because what we need to do is we need to quickly as hell get to uh, 60 inventor points so we can at least unlock that guy. Um, these are 20 apiece. Alright, so what's that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So we need, it's 140 logs across there alone. Um, what about through here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So that's 100. There's nowhere near as many trees though. Although they do have more wood in them. No, they don't. They've got one. So that's kind of stupid. Alright. Good. Here's the water. Uh, prioritize you. So now someone's gone out of one of those. Uh, we'll prioritize you. And prioritize... Yeah, the last one. Okay. Uh, you're not doing anything? No. Uh, we need somewhere to store the food. But at the same time... Is that going to be enough water pumped in? Probably not. I mean, it's only, what, 12 logs? Is that what it was? Yeah, that, that, that should be fine. We should be able to get that tomorrow. Oh, well-being minus one. Because someone's thirsty. Um, okay. And there's no housing, of course. We should probably put in one, shouldn't we? That's a lot of wood, though. And look, look how much we've used up already. Alright, prioritize you. So who doesn't have a beaver? Those two don't. Okay, that's fine. Um, we'll just do this. Although we... Mm. Once these are built... Uh, what we'll do, actually, is we'll go like this. Alright. How is it not enough water? Come on, guys. In my last playtest of this, I only had two pumps. And it was more than enough. Right, let's fire two people out of there as well. I just I forgot all about that. Oh, there's 20 water stored inside the buildings. They don't haul when they've got nothing to do? For real? Weird. Wait, why is no one hauling the water? Is it because they're doing... I guess it's because they're doing this, eh? Alright. Let's fire you from there for a sec. No, still not. I mean, they changed the game a little, but I didn't expect it to be changed this much. Wait, hang on. Oh my god, what the hell's this? No friggin' kidding! Oh wow. Okay. The storage tanks hold multiple things. 
It, yeah, it just says stores liquids. It doesn't say stores water anymore. Oh, that is friggin' awesome. Speaking of friggin' awesome, um, no. You, yes, more, more people in you, please. Um, drop those two out of that. Good, we've got finally got beef of being grown, and we've got person that. Yes, all right. We need that forester ASAP. Um, because this is where we're going to sit for a sec. Our, because the, the other problem is, is we need to replace beavers as they die. So this is going to be a fun run, guys. Um, <clears throat> we're going to probably go through at least one death spiral. I'm hoping not to, but we're going to go through at least one. Um, we also have one homeless person. Oh, great. Ah, sorry, homeless beaver. Um... I'm thinking we, we, we dam across here. Later on, we'll dam this off. <clears throat> and all this will fill up with water. But we're not going to be able to get there. And I don't know if we'll... Act oh, God damn it. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. We've almost gone through it all. Alright. Um, I don't like the idea of taking out the... But we need to get over there. There's not going to be a straight road anymore. Um, Stuff it. We'll make the straight road, sort of. Um, uh, we'll tell them to cut these down. Straight through there. And we'll put a road in. That way we can get to these trees as well, because we're going to need to. Uh, we're going to need them. See, at the moment, we don't even have enough to build two dam blocks. And the other reason we need the... um. Um, what do you call it? <clears throat> the, the thing. Uh, oh, actually, no. Let's... Alright. No. 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 We're building this first. Um. Oh, it's just going to be tricky. Alright. Uh, food. Because you take four days. You take six days. But it's got... Does it have to grow first? No, because it's, like, it's not like the trees. Um... Let's start with carrots, because I don't know how far away the first drought is. Um, food. Although I'm going to wish I'd done potatoes, aren't I? Um, yeah, let's go. Prioritize this. Uh, prioritize cutting first. That's not going to be enough bloody um, carrots. <clears throat> But this is going to be nowhere near enough of these. Uh, which could have been... This, see, this... I could be making a massive mistake right now. Instead of saving up my wood and, and cutting across here. And then saving it up for the forester so that we can then um, replace these. Because uh, these need a forester to plant them. Oh! Yeah! Well being level 4. We're almost at the end of the first week. Ugh. We have no food. Because they're... Right, hang on. We need to start pausing these. Because they take um, berries and water. Um, although they are growing up rather fast. Okay. Good. Uh, prioritize resource. Carrot. And then what we'll do is we'll also start putting in the potatoes. Just in case. We'll put them in here. Just in case we do manage to get them in in time. Well, I'm not sure when the drought is. It could be tomorrow. In which case, everything, everyone dies. <laughs> uh, unless we grab another one of you, maybe? Because how many do you hold? Three berries. So that's six bushes, bushes each it holds. Okay. Oh, my God. Yeah, I see everyone's hungry. I don't know. Did they literally eat all of it? Man, there's even this. I didn't see that. Oh, these guys do chestnuts and dandelions as well? Huh. Okay. Well, that's different. Alright. Then we'll start the dams up. Uh, put a gap. Or do we just go straight from here? Straight from there. 
Right. Okay. That's going to chew through all our wood. But it will mean that we do have a supply of food. Uh, we also need to get to... We got there. All right. Uh, wood. We need you. And we'll stick that in there. Cool. That way we can regrow all these trees. Whew, and hopefully avert a bloody disaster. Alright, you are uh, grilled potatoes. Um, let's prioritize you over those. Yep, okay. Yeah, should have got these in a lot bloody sooner. Never mind. Alright, they have nothing to do. Let's get in some more... Some more of these. Actually, we'll just do the whole bloody lot. Stuff it. We can remove it later if we need to. The more food we have in stock, the better. And if we can prevent them from eating the... Can we stop them eating blueberries eventually? Is there a way to actually do that? Uh, no. It'd be nice if there was. <clears throat> but they will uh, prioritize the cooked food over the non-cooked food. Does it give you uh, how long? <clears throat> oh, 23%? Okay, so that's halfway there. So two more days. Day 9, cycle 1. Okay. I don't know how many days per, per cycle there is. So we're all in for a bloody treat on that one. Right, you can get that. Cool. Uh, you pause because there's nothing for you to do. Okay, so yeah, this is the Helix map. <clears throat> it's very tight. It's very compact. There are some areas we can kind of spread out into. Um, other things we can dig out. Like, for example, we could put the earth digging thing for the golems up on here and dig that whole thing out. Um, we could do that. We could also flood it. <clears throat> it's like a football basin. Uh, as for perpetual power systems, <clears throat> this, this map might actually be easier for it because there's this. The water's already up here. We don't have to pump it up. It's already up. And I'm wondering, right, these guys have, they have a large power, large water, dude, right we can literally just utilize this entire thing. I mean, we'd still have to pump the water back up there. But we don't have to dig the trench. It's already made for us. Right? I don't know. We'll look at that. Because what we're going to do is we're going to build up into this plateau here. And we're going to dam all this off. Put a spillway and, uh, and uh, floodgates on it. So the water trickles out all the time, but also, you know, fills this up. Or what we could also do is build a bit of a bypass so the water comes down and flows straight down here. Something to think about. 93%. Uh, all right, we will get onto the carrots before we run actually run out of... Um... Nope, I take that back. We have run out of food. <laughs> oh, that was close. Oh my god, that was close. Oh, dude. We might actually avert the first, um, the, um, the death spiral. Although we've got one born for four adults, so I don't know. If we can avoid that first death spiral, though, I'd be happy. Uh, prioritize harvesting, please. Yep, good. Oh, it's going to be magnificent if we can do that. Ah, here it is. Three days time. Here it comes. Oh, this will all be done by then? Nice. Okay. Uh, then we'll clear all of this out and we'll, f and we'll change it over to potatoes. Actually, we're going to do this right now. Because that's four days. We're going to change you guys over to potato. And you guys. And you guys. All right. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, man, I was not expecting that. Oh, water's going to be our problem, though, isn't it? Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Even their blocks look like a different color, right? Like they're gray instead of, uh, like brown. <laughs> I love the INT. 
I've only ever played them like twice, and both times I failed. So, third time's charm. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, two homeless. We need another house, but I'd rather this finished first. They can sleep on the damn floor. I've almost got it. We just need to get up here. Someone prioritize this. Can we do that? Yep. Because you guys are almost. You guys are too far away. Oh, no, no. We'll let me get that first. Now you're too far away. And uh, now I saw you. All right. Let's get the road in here. Put another road right there. Get the wood cutty guy. Put you right there. Perfect. He can get all that. All right. That'll trickle it in. Oh, we need a lot more than a trickle though. Look at that. It's working already. <laughs> it's half blocked off. We don't have damn blocks. They require um, you to unlock them. And I can't remember the next thing we need to unlock. But it is bloody important. Ah, never mind. What the hell? Is that a box of carrots? Right, we don't have a storage. Oh my god. <laughs> what a dummy. Uh, okay. Uh, let's put it there. Damn it. There goes the wood. Uh, all right, let's let's rush it. Wait. Oh, dude, it's freaking recycling. What? So this must have been the the wood that was inside. Oh, dude, that's why that says zero. Uh, great. Okay, that was that was brilliant, Daniel. Well done, you dummy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Hey, wait, what? Small industrial. Dude, it's a single block? What if I put it there? <laughs> Mate. Oh, that is fantastic. Oh, that is cool as well done. Right, does this do anything different? Okay. Uh. Wait, it only accepts... Okay, how does it accept more than one? Where's my carrots at? No. Uh oh. Uh. Okay. Oh, here's the drought. Damn it! Just before we got the dam finished. Although we still might. Um, can I prioritize these? And over that. Um, this and this. We need literally 20 more. There's 20 sitting right here. Oh, come on. And they're, what do you mean? Oh, bollocks. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Go, boys, go. Uh, I need to prioritize this then, don't I? How many more do you need? Heaps. Come on. The water's about to stop, isn't it? Yeah, it already has. Shit. Uh oh. Uh-oh. This could be problematic. Damn it. Damn it all to hell. We're going to need a large storage area now, though, aren't we? Oh, well, once the drought's over, we'll, we, we, we should be able to then uh, finish building this. Oh, it needs planks. Crap. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Berg oversight on my behalf. Massive. All right. Put you there. Power wheel. We need a power wheel. Which needs a road. All right? Pretty sure these things need road connections. Oh, damn. That sucks. Um, let's just lower you down one. 
So someone comes and builds this first. Uh, what have we got here? The one unemployed? Yep, there goes the water. Oh, that's, that's, oh, oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> well, at least it's only 1.4 days, so it should be okay. Oh, that is fantastic. Oh, mate. Good job, guys. Good job. All right, we'll roll this through to the end of the, uh, end of the drought. Make sure we haven't killed ourselves. We did manage to get some food in. Not much of it, but we got some. We got no... Oh, we do have potatoes. We just need to unpause you. And then fire you. Alright, so at least we can make some spuds. Some grilled spuds. Yeah, alright. When the drought's over, we'll have that. Far out, finally. Alright, we just need the ten planks. So we need you guys. Probably you're more important. Followed by you. Okay. Uh, harvest is more important. Good. Good, 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 good. Yeah, okay, so we've got food. We've got water. All right, we're good. We are good. Oh. Oh, you see what I mean? Like, you've got to rush to get some of this stuff out as soon as possible. Does that sound like the Streamlabs alert when you get a subscriber to anyone else? I keep thinking that's what it is every time it goes off. Oh, we've got an injury. Guess we better do this, otherwise he won't work. Does it look the same? Bro, even that looks different. Dude. A lot of changes, a lot of changes. I love it. Alright, yeah, so the water will now come out of this guy. Boop, 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 boop. Eventually. I think we see it going up. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Here it comes. Uh, it would also, would also be nice to tap into this one as well, because this one's quicker. Because it would run down here. Dad, make this a waterfall. Oh, dude. <laughs> oh, I was going to say, I, I was panicking a little, but nah, because I've done this before, except I had a death spiral, and we still might, because I don't have any berries. And um, I've got nowhere to grow anymore. And these are the only two breeding pods we've got running. That needs a plank. So yeah, we need these. And we need more population. Way more population. Although these guys don't need to be doing anything right now. The drought is practically over. But they don't need to be there until the water arrives. So they can help in other things. Like, someone build this. Oh, it's 40 logs. Do we even have access to 40 logs? Maybe. Maybe. It's only 10 of these trees over here. Alright, while this is all rubbish, let's, um, can we build this straight through this? Yes, we can. Then we'll put a lumberjack flag over here and cut them down. Oh, man, that's a, that's a balance. Uh, right, yeah, because once we've got this, we've, I think we're fine. We just got to grow at, um, at sort of a, a cor Hello, the correct bye. speed. Not you, you. Okay, uh, because we need someone to run the bloody wheel. Water's almost out. Uh, better turn you guys on. Um, we'll pause you, I suppose. We don't technically need you now. Actually, we'll just get rid of it. It's got 20 logs, so we're not getting rid of it. You got 19, okay. And that's empty. All right, here comes the water. Oh, I would love to have had this dam up before the, um... Shit, it was, it was destroying this that cost me it. Alright, now we can start getting the berries back. But they're going to take 12 days. So it's 12 days to grow the plant, then 12 days to grow, for the plant to then grow the berries. Um, right, uh, no, potatoes, 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 nothing but spuds, spuddies, spuddies, I'm just gonna go straight for spuds, right, oh, uh, wait, hang on, potato, 
Yes. Okay. Just making sure I click the right bloody thing. All right. All right, guys. I might leave this one here. So this is the start of the new Iron Teeth Helix. Um, yeah, we have to wait until, until more water comes in. Otherwise, it's just going to keep running off like that. Um, need more berries. All right. So this is the start of Iron Teeth Helix. We will try and get there. Uh, we have had one, two. We've had two deaths. We're going to unpause this. Um, once this guy is up and running, which is after this guy is up and running. Ah, nice. Ten more logs. We'll get that. We will then uh, plant out trees in here and um, blueberries as well. We'll move our scavenger flag over this way. Uh, so that way we can start damming this off over here. That's going to be the next thing we do is we head over and dam this off. So that all this stays irrigated and we can start moving our farmland this way and bring our industry over here. I think over here. It's going to rely on, on um, the water wheels though. Okay, come on. Flow, water flow. This is going to happen a little bit until the, cat until the water catches up. Alright guys, hope you've enjoyed this. Like, share, comment, and subscribe if you did. If you didn't, thanks for watching this long, you weirdo. <laughs> uh, if you'd like to help the channel out, there'll be links in the description. Anything helps, but either way, I'll see you in the next one.